Hey Canva creators, Katie Chadwick here. Today we are going to be talking about how you can make your designs more cohesive by pulling colors from the photos you plan on using. And one of the quickest, easiest ways to do that is with the color dropper inside of Canva's platform. So all you have to do in order to get access to that is click the, click the element you wish to recolor. So you can see it's selected because of the purple box around it. I'm going to go up here to color. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click this gradient, the rainbow gradient. It's going to say add a new color. And all I have to do is go right here to where it says pick a color from the design. Now, this is where it gets a little bit more granular, right? Because you have to get pretty precise in order to pull a color. Maybe you wanted a little bit of a lighter, um, but not too light, like over here. So I'm going to go right here. And as you can see, it pulled that orange, but it's so funny because the pixels are so small. It doesn't look like it's that bright orange, but it is. What I'm going to do, I want something a little bit less like Halloween Town because we're not quite there yet. Soon enough, we will be, but a little bit more brown. So I'm going to grab this pixel right here. And as you can see, it's that brown from the house. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to change the color white. And you can make it bold if you're a bold person. If not, you can make it italic, you can make it normal. But as you can see here, it's quite easy to grab colors from the images right here. And you can also, I don't know if you noticed, but it says photo color see all. If you have any photos inside your design, Canva will automatically pull some colors for you, which might save you a lot of time if you're not into the if you're not really caring is more of a precise color. So hope that was helpful and can't wait to see you use it in your designs moving forward.